Well, you will have seen in the statement issued today by the government and Dr. Burke that we have been able to resolve the issues which Dr. Burke believed were in dispute and which he has now understood as a result of a period of ill health where he had lost contact with the GHA. He didn't understand some of what was being done. So I'm very pleased that, in fact, there has been an ability to resolve the differences that there were. But I can tell you that the settlement is that Dr. Burke is withdrawing his case and accepting that there should not be a repetition of of the allegations that was making on the basis of absolutely no payment whatsoever being made by the government to Dr. Burke and Dr. Burke just making the decision with the information that he's been provided by the government that he should withdraw his claim against uh, the GHA and others which you've referred to. Was the information furnished by the government that the government would perhaps take uh, any counter legal action? No, this is a this is a two pronged position. The government has an obligation on behalf of all of the patients of the GHA to always act to protect the information that belongs to those patients. And at the same time, the government was prepared to provide other information to Dr. Burke about the structural changes being undertaken by the GHA, which satisfied him that some of the things that he believed were not happening were actually happening and he just was not aware of them.